they don't like they don't like uh natural black women. That's the guys I experience and the guys that I see all the time. If women are getting weaves and nails for themselves, how are we putting what say this person I saw distracting me? If women are getting weaves and nails for themselves, how are men pressuring women to do it? The reason they're getting it for themselves to a certain extent, but women's power in society is based off of beauty, right? Mm -hmm. Men's is based off of being able to provide. Mm -hmm. You can work your way up to providing, but it's only so many things that you can do to become beautiful. I can only upgrade myself so much unless I go get the freaking, you see tiny, you know, tiny. Um, yeah. She don't yeah. want to got her boobs done, her butt done, her eyes freaking ripped out of her eyeballs and replaced with contacts. Like, it's a whole thing. It's only so much upgrading you can do. So, so, and so, can be broke and get rich tomorrow, and he'll have tons of women come to him. I can't change my DNA. I can't be white tomorrow. All right, so quick talk to me. So, um, it's a real quick question. Will you prefer a man? that you have to build with but they they stay unfaithful or men who is stable but they're a cheater you gotta know which one i'm gonna pick the, the faithful one the, faithful the first one. one because you can like i said you can build with somebody y'all can build with tomorrow i mean not with tomorrow y'all can build tomorrow and tomorrow and the day after that and the day after that and be rich eventually if he's stable and he's cheating that's no loyalty it's no loyalty would you rather have a homeboy that um ha that has no loyalty to you no no because no. he'll say you out to the next dude down the street that's true that's true but but um all right so a lot of the those men who are stable i mean who are still building mm -hmm. they are men that perform more natural women these more rich men have the crazy expectations of women so they are i don't even think you even care about those men you don't even want them based on what it's, you just said it's not because the thing is the, you want to know what it is money doesn't change your character if you have a shitty character and you're broke when you get rich you're gonna have a crappy character so i feel like the money only affects you if you're just bad from the inside hold on because these people you y'all hear all that you good we hear you you good okay it's just for me character money only brings out your real self mm -hmm. honestly you'll say i don't want rich man but if the rich man has good character why not date him you know what i I'm understand saying? because it's a lot of thieving and conniving, conniving broke people would you let a thief stay in your house thieves aren't rich most of them aren't rich most thieves are broke so if they just have crappy character from the beginning it don't really matter if they have money or not Okay, so why do you guys ignore when men say we don't care about the surgeries, we don't care about the weave, and then some women say it's not for y'all, it's for us. But it's, well, it's a great. Them, some, some of them women are lying. They're, they're lying. lying. They're lying. Okay. Talk about okay. it. Let's get to it. Some women are lying. Most of these women that are risking their lives to go get their butt and bodies done across the waters, they're mm -hmm. doing it for a man or whoever they're attracted to. Because if, as a woman, what's the purpose of having a big butt? When I look at a girl with a big booty, I don't get aroused in no kind of way. When men like that. So, oh, I'm just sent me something. So, when, when, when these women say, oh, I'm doing it for myself, it depends. If some people are, I'm not mm -hmm. going to lie. When I got my eyebrows microbladed, that was for me because makeup and all of that stuff. But butts and all of this, people just want, and some people do it low key for a better lifestyle. Instagram models, as soon as they get that booty, as soon as they get that light bulb, the lights go up, their options go up. I will say that. I will say that, um, I will say that some men like it, but the men that don't like it organically, I don't think those are men that you want, to be honest but with they, you. Men say they don't care if it's fake. I mean, they say they care if it's fake, but they don't. Some men don't, unless they're the only man I say don't care it's like the ones that's in the gym because you know you can't really work out when you you know get out the faha the lipo the drains all of that stuff you can't really work out like that like some men like athletic women but the ones that don't that just randomly just swipe up all day on instagram models pages they don't care if it's real or fake and I, a lot I got, of these women know that i gotta i gotta have a, like a, a hunch a strong hunch most of men that they're in line 
with the way that you want to think, don't want that. They don't care about it. Most of them that, that you would have a better life with moving forward and living more, living forever, I think but they I don't, don't want no that. Surgery. Huh? I don't want no surgery. Okay. So. I'm just saying. So, so a lot of the women that end up dealing with these men that do want those fake bodies and stuff like that, those are men that's even mentally, they not even on the same stratosphere as a normal guy, a regular guy. On, on my, I try to speak to the regular man, the normal mm -hmm. man, and prefer his more realistic thing that probably makes between 50 to 70K a year, probably even 40 to 70K a year, those men. Because those are, those are much more the majority, the realistic men, so they have much more realistic expectations. So when you have, when you are talking to them and you say that, most men want these women with the, the weaves or stuff like that. Sometimes men get frustrated having a way for these chicks to even put on the makeup, get a head on. We just want to go. I just want to spend time with my lady. Now, you, we, 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 I will say with the hair and the makeup, it is for women. We just, some people just like girl, girl. Some people just like look good. Um, and I will say also with, when it comes to the body and the surgery, you got to look at how old they are. You got to look at, um, when they're doing it, why they're doing it. Because some women, after you have a baby, your body just changes. Like, men don't experience that. You get this little extra flap. Some things don't suck back up like how they're supposed to. So if they get it after that, I get it. But when you're 18, um, 19, 20, from 18 to 23, 24, you should not even be worried about surgery unless you just built like a vacuum stuck up your booty and you just got nothing back there. I understand I understand. Okay. But, but you in the gym though. No. Man, let's, let's put it. Let's put it Some people in the just gym though. No. Some people just don't have naturally decent bodies. My body is decent by society standards, right? So, okay. Okay. So my body is decent. So I don't let's have switch to go, it up. go that far. What do you think about women that mm -hmm. feel like take me as I am? What do you think about those women? Talk to me. Take me as I am. I take mean, me why, as why I am. Can, why can't you take them as they are? They're doing it because somebody's opposing them. You know what I'm saying? They wouldn't say it if it wasn't a reason to say it. Take me as I am with the weave, with the afro, with the bad body, all that stuff. Because some of these men be wanting the most perfect woman. And then you look at them and be like, you sure, my guy, you want, you're not that guy. You're not that guy. Okay. You you want all of this, but you shake Come on, Rick so, Ross won't Larry Galore, but look at Rick Ross. I mean, but listen, it's, it's a difference. Mm -hmm. You know, men are much more visual than women, except yeah. you. You you say you you wait. No, that's what I yeah, that's what I said. You wait, you wait. Looks a little bit more higher, but men are much more visual than women. So yeah. that take me as I am shit don't rock that much with us. Why? It don't work because, like, to take me as in more so, so revolves around. Is it? Is it the bonnets? No, I mean, I care. About, I care. about, Yes, look, look some. Look, look. Represent yourself and your family. Represent yourself. Don't be looking crazy. That's you representing me. But when I say about that, as far as you should be working on yourself too. Don't just say take me as I am. Is it? Is I'm it something that, that you gotta be all the time? Like, cause no. I don't want to look like Beyonce all the time. Sometimes yeah, it's I'm not, not about, about that. Bonnet. You can't change your face. It's no, not about that. Y'all don't like y'all don't like disheveledness. I notice a lot of men want women pristine all the time. So okay, is it that? Not that's what I'm talking about. Why? Do, it's you go to the gym because mm -hmm. you want to look good. I go to the gym for my mental health and because I want to look good. Okay, those two, mental health and want to look good. It's some women who don't want to. Work out or try to put them put their cars in the race. Remember earlier we were talking about you working out is putting your car in the race for a certain type of men because they like attract the women with nice bodies. Mm -hmm. Some women think I'm not gonna work out, I'm not gonna get myself in shape, you're gonna take me as I am, and God will find me the perfect man that will set me as I am. Okay. Well see what I'm saying? I do agree with the woman because men I do, I do because Looks are only going to last so long. When I'm old and wrinkly, you gonna leave me for somebody younger? That's not the person I'm supposed to be with in the first place. Now, if she chooses, if she chooses to be that way, she can't expect a certain type of guy. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. She can't expect okay. a certain type of guy. 
when I go to the gym, I don't go to the gym for me. I go to the gym because it 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 de-stresses me. I like doing it. Somebody said, I just <laughs> I just subscribed to Nita. Send her five on the Cash App. I like the conversation. Not much, but hey, I ain't read. Appreciate the super chat, man. I said, I said money. Did I say money was last? Yeah. I put money last. It, you know, I'm broken than you, so it don't matter. I ain't sending nobody nothing on the internet. You crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what you was saying, go, go better what you saying. Uh huh. Um, go ahead. So, take me as you saying, you were saying, um, I can't remember what you were saying. I'm sorry. No, so Stacy, Stacy, what kind of body you got right now? Right now, yeah, I'm, I'm big. What's I'm big than I've ever been. Big, like muscle, or big, like fat. I mean, I'm big, strong, but it's still, I still have fat. You got I have no, more, I got, fat. I'm the strongest I've ever been and more fat than I ever had. So what if your girl said tomorrow, look, look, Stacey, I don't need that much cushion for the pushing. You got to go, you know, drop a couple of pounds in like two weeks. That's the only way I'm going to stay with you, Stacey. That's the the only, what you going gonna to tell her? You going to be like, gym. hell no, I'm me. That's what I'm going to the gym. So you will go to the gym just because your old lady say you need to change. If I want to, I want to be with if her. If you want, it's a choice thing. I feel like yeah. it's a lot of give and take. If she's single and she's saying, okay, it is what it is. Take me as I am. She's going to have to expect a certain type, kind of guy. If she wants something that's a little bit up the scale, she would have to change some things. But that's up to her. Some people don't care about changing themselves. Um, but that's not me. Okay. I'm realistic. So, so being, being yourself, yourself is not good enough. enough. For a certain type of That's people. not it. That's We're not saying being yourself. We're saying be the best version of yourself. Not saying being yourself. That's not and what I'm saying. Be the best version of yourself based off of what you think, not off of what society thinks. Because if you're going off of Instagram, you'll never be good enough, ever. Men are visually stimulated more than women. Women to, tend to be sapo, sex, sapiosexual? What is Sep that? Sapiosexual. What is that? Um, they more so attracted to uh, personalities. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But if you super duper funny looking, then no. Okay. Take me as I am is irrelevant because if you're not evolving daily, you can't move forward with me. Get right or get left. Exactly. Exactly. I fuss with that crystal. Okay. Bond is a sign of being unready. What's, why y'all be hating the bond? Where is my bond at? Don't put that shit on. Don't put it. I'll, take, I'll, I'll turn your camera on. on. I'll turn your camera on. Don't you put that shit on. <laughs> You gonna respect the platform and the people in the comment section. What is the where's my money at? You gonna put that shit on? Hell no! Don't do that. Y'all lucky I ain't got my money. All right. You should be able to lift your own body weight. How can you? How can you walk around every day with your weight and can't move right? Now you better be careful, W, because they gonna say you fat phobic. Because that's what they tell me. Oh, we. Oh, you done went in. That's that's all surprise. But what you saying? They went in on you. They don't. They don't. They home, but they didn't change your mind. You being much more nice. What is for me? They went in on you about you, your um your rant about weight. Oh, fat people. No, yeah. people. Honestly, with that fat video, people were just coming from the Kevin Samuels video, and they were just bitching about nothing. If you are morbidly obese and you live a regular life like a regular, a normal sized person, you are going to die sooner. That's just fact. If if both people. If both people are living a life, if there were no free accidents, no car accidents, no cancers, no nothing, if both of y'all live a regular life, not naturally, you are going to die faster. You're morbidly obese, not a little bit overweight. If you're, you can't get out your damn bed, you're going to die faster. That's just Talk fat. And people, oh, you're fat phobic. That's not the truth. So you want me to lie to you? A lot of people want you to lie. And the same people that sit there and enable that, you know, the same people listen to Kevin Sanders and be like, oh, Kevin, say it. You better, they don't want to hear the truth. But as soon as I say you, you, you're big, it's a problem. <laughs> or if I say it's not healthy, if you're 100 pounds overweight, then it's a problem. I don't get that. Hey, I feel, I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. All right. Let's be real as well. Women look good to compete with other women. All the male attention is an added bonus for annoying women. Like I said, women are naturally competitive. But if there were no men, women would, would not compete. Like if mm. everybody was just heterosexual, women would not compete. Half, honestly, half of the women that y'all see on Instagram, they're doing it for a man. All the Instagram models, 
they're doing it for a man. Most of them. Rich men. Rich men. Rich men. Yeah. Rich no men. No money. Tell a woman to, oh my God. This man is, tell a woman to lose weight. She will leave you, then lose weight for the next guy. Oh, well, she won't even thank her ex. I mean, most thank women that lose weight, okay, you can't just come up to a woman and say, bitch, you get it back. You got to ease into it. You got to be like, baby, you know what? Let's let's go to, you ever thought about going to the gym? You know, you ever thought about not eating burger game today? That's how you got to ease yourself into it. Now, as far as her losing weight for the next guy, I don't think that's what happens. I think what happens is, one, she's depressed and she's not eating, so she lose weight. Or two, she finds self-confidence in, in the gym, and she just magically ended up finding another guy. And why would she have to thank, thank her ex, unless she's still cool with her ex? Screw your ex. Screw him. Or her. Whoever it is. So dudes are right. going to gym. Dudes are going to gym after a breakup. Yeah. Do y'all even cry? I feel like men don't even cry. I can't stand that. Cry to me. Not all the time. We not gonna tell you if you cry or not. Come on now. Huh? Men, the men I come across, they act like as soon as you shed a tear, you saw. So you ain't gonna know nothing. We ain't gonna tell you that. You will never know. Cry you will never to know. Me. Why? Cry to you? Why? You. I'm just why? What you would do? If a nigga cry to you, what you gonna do? It depends what he's about? crying about. He gotta be crying about something that's worth crying for. Like, uh, what's something that some would cry about? Like, say your whole bank account just got wiped out. Your whole YouTube channel just got deleted. Oh, oh, I'm boo-hooing. You got to shed a tear. Or it's something oh, like, shit, oh, my mama serious. died. Or something serious. If it's something like, oh, what's something simple to cry over? Oh, I stubbed my toe. I'm crying. Yet women can make a thing about guys hiding, but they can't ask them to consider a weight conversation um i get where you're coming from with the height thing but weight is something you can control height is something you can't control okay the only way you, you can't get bone surgery to get taller but you have control over weight women also women a lot of women gain weight uh fast because of estrogen some men have high estrogen too mm. so it depends the man has to lead by example. When my fiance gained weight, I asked her if she wanted to come to the gym with me, and she jumped up so fast. Mm, that's dope. You a real nigga. You a real nigga, bro. Yes, because some people will sit there and let their woman fester in their bigness. And but the thing is, you got to be a little bit considered serious too, because women gain weight faster, and they have those babies. Mm -hmm. Those babies will put some weight on you if you just eat while you're pregnant. So good for you. I like men that do that. Take your lady to the gym, because I'm tired of being the only woman in there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's okay. wrong. Looks initially attract someone to act otherwise is ridiculous for bothering men and women. That's true. But it's only so far the looks can take you. You normally know someone's personality, I want to say the first couple of times of meeting them. It was a dude the other day came up to me, 23 years old, came up to me talking about some oh um I can do this, that and third for you. Um, you'll want to F me as soon as we get time together. I'm trying to sleep with me the first time I saw him, right? You just know people's personality. He was okay looking, but if somebody that didn't look as good came to me and they were a better person, that would be some further. Listen, take you so far. hey man, hey fellas, dog, I, I be hating some of y'all niggas games. I be hearing <laughs> from my ladies' friend, my homegirls, y'all be having the worst game ever, bro. When you meet a chick, first thing you need to do is get them to start talking. If they're attracted to you, all you can do is fuck it up. So just get them to start talking. Once you understand more about them, then you figure out how you how you can fit into their life. Stop just trying to just I can do this, I can do that. Like, come on, dog. It's not I'm, a fucking job in me. Let me give y'all some advice um for some men. You can a woman knows first you gotta gauge and test the words to see if she's attracted to you. Because you, if a woman is attracted to you and you come up and say something stupid like hamburger, she'll automatically take interest. But if she's not attracted to you, you can come up to her and say, um, I can help you how to change your life. I can help you do this, that, and the third. She's not interested in you. So no matter what you do, I mean, that door isn't open. Mm -hmm. You got to test the waters to see if, she, if she's attracted to you first. And you have to see if she's a gold digger first. Because a lot of women will pretend to like you just to get money from you. And that's mm -hmm. not me, you know, being a pick me woman, but I do know a lot of gold diggers that pretend to like men for money. Just mm -hmm. like a lot of dudes pretend to like women just so they can sleep with them. 
Is this true? Is this true?